Chapter 5, Hydrocarbons 5.1, Alkenes What are hydrocarbons? Hydrocarbons are organic compounds that contain only carbon and hydrogen atoms. There are two classes of hydrocarbons. They are saturated and unsaturated hydrocarbons. A saturated hydrocarbon contains only single bonds between its atom. This class is represented by alkenes as well as cycloalkenes. An unsaturated hydrocarbon contains at least one carbon-carbon double bond or triple bond in its molecule. Alkenes, alkynes, arenes are representative of this class. The saturated hydrocarbons can be divided into aliphatic and aromatic compounds. In aliphatic hydrocarbons, carbon atoms are arranged in an open chain structure and non-aromatic ring, while for aromatic hydrocarbons contain at least one benzene ring in their structures. Alkenes have both a cyclic, which is open chain, and cyclic. Alkenes with four or more carbons can have straight chain or branch chain isomers. The example of straight chain isomers is pentane, while the branch chain isomer is 2 methyl butane. Cyclopropane, cyclobutane, cyclopentane and cyclohexane are examples of cyclic alkenes. Alkenes are saturated hydrocarbons which contain only single covalent bonds between their atoms. Alkenes do not have any functional group the carbon chains in alkenes may be linear, branch or cyclic. Each carbon atom in alkenes is sp3 hybridized with four sigma bonds. The general formula for open chain alkenes is CnH2n plus 2, while for cycloalkenes CnH2n, where N is the number of carbon atoms in one molecule. The molecular formulae, boiling point, melting point, and names of the first 10 linear alkenes are given in the following table. Naming alkenes. The name of every organic molecule has three parts. Parent name, suffix, prefix. Parent name indicates the number of carbon atoms in the longest continuous carbon chain in the molecule. Suffix indicates what functional group is present. Prefix tells the identity, location and number of substituents attached to the carbon chain. Alkenes are named using a prefix that designates the number of carbon atoms in the molecule. 
In order to name alkenes and other organic compounds, you must first rememberize this table. The names, molecular formulae, and structural formulae of the first 10 linear alkenes are given in the following table. Alkyls are named from the corresponding alkenes by substituting the suffix in with il. To name alkyl group, the in ending of parent alkene to il. Thus, methane becomes metal. The names of several alkyls and other substituents are given in the following table. 